are heading south on Highway 65, and that's a good sign. Well, usually it is. Yeah, I do have to go south on 65 right. to work every day. Work isn't bad, but it is work, and I would much be rather doing something fun like today and pulling Monty because yep. we're going camping. Why are you not at school? Because it is the first day of summer vacation. Woohoo! That's right. I took a half day off work, and we are heading to Table Rock State Park. It is Friday afternoon. We're going to have a nice weekend there. We really enjoy the Corps of Engineers parks all around the lake area, and that's where we typically camp. But today we are going to Table Rock State Park, and uh, we're going to go check it out. Yeah, we really do love Missouri State Parks. We visited a lot of them when they had their Centennial Passport Program. They had this little thing where you could check off all the parks that you went and visited, and we've seen almost all of the ones in the state. But we haven't camped at many, and we haven't camped at Table Rock State Park, even though even when we lived in Branson, we went there all the time just to go down and see the lake and go boating and things like that. But we're excited to check out the campground, and this one is nice compared to many of the state parks because this one has full hookups. Most of Missouri state parks don't have uh, 50 amp service at all of the parks um, and not necessarily have water at the sites. Uh, so this one is gonna be a nice one. It's got all the good stuff. So come along with us, check out the park and enjoy our adventure day. The shower houses at the campground are pretty okay. They have individual shower stalls, meaning its own individual room that hopefully you can kind of see right here. So it's just kind of concrete showers and has a, a hook for your clothes and a concrete bench, but fairly clean for a campground bathroom. This campground does have a laundry facility available. It looks like it has a couple washers and a couple dryers. Also has a big sink if you need to rinse things out, but kind of a nice added feature. The campground was easy to maneuver. There's plenty of room to turn corners. It's always nice when the roads are completely paved, the sites are wide, and there was no issue backing into place. Here's an example of one of the full hookup 50 amp sites. This is site number 263. Paved pad, picnic table, fire ring, 50 amp, water, and sewer. So here we are at site 214. Some of the sites at this campground have full hookups. Others are completely primitive. This one does not have electric, water, or sewer. But what a beautiful sight. Picnic table, fire ring, lots of trees, lots of shade. Just a gorgeous place to camp if you can get by with dry camping. One of the nice features of Table Rock State Park is the State Park Marina. At this marina, they have lots of boat rentals. You can get anything from pontoon boats to ski boats to jet skis. They even have paddle boards and kayaks, so lots of family-friendly things. And if you're camping at the campground, you get a 10% discount on those rentals, so nice feature. They also have a really nice store that has all kinds of things that you would expect at a marina store. They're gonna have sunscreen and beachwear and flip flops and all that kind of good stuff. One of our local favorite barbecue places, which is called Dana's Barbecue, they have a store that opens up on Memorial Day weekend, so that's a fun thing. If you wanna not cook one night at your campsite, you can come over and get some Dana's Barbecue and then hit the boat rentals to go out on the lake. Lots of cool things at the State Park Marina. The Spirit of America is a 49 passenger catamaran that does tours of Table Rock Lake. They even take you out onto a cove where they have inflatables and swimming. Lots of fun. Definitely check it out. The Lakeshore Trail is a 4.4 mile 
trail that goes right along Table Rock Lake, right here in the state park, and it connects both of the campgrounds, the marina, and the day use area. The other cool thing about this trail is that it takes you all the way to the Dewey Short Visitor Center up by the dam and to the Branson Bell parking lot. So if you wanted to go on a tour of the Branson Bell and go out for a paddle wheel boat ride, you could actually walk from your campground to the boat. Our camping trip to Table Rock State Park has been a good one. We really do like this park. There's access for all kinds of different types of campers. If you are somebody who camps in a class A, there's sites for you. If you have a small travel trailer, there's sites for you. They even have yurts that you can rent. If you don't have a camper or a tent or anything, you can rent a yurt. But it's kind of fun to see all the different kinds of uh, RVers and campers, everybody from tent campers to people who are dry camping to people out here in full class A's. Pretty cool campground. And it was a beautiful sunset this evening by the lake. We really enjoyed the Lakeshore Trail. Yes, awesome Got to trail. see the Branson Bell go by again yeah. under the setting sun. So um, a fantastic campground, a fun day, and it's a place we would want to come back for sure. Definitely. So if you're going to have an adventure day in Branson, Missouri, and you need a campground, you might check out Table Rock State Park. Campground 2 is where we stayed, and it's really nice. So come back. Uh, enjoy some more of our videos. Be sure to subscribe, give us a thumbs up, and uh, come back soon because today is an adventure day.